You lost your, your guy. But it's alright, we won't hold it against you. Except everyone. Jump Probably again! Over. Oh shit. Oh well. That'll be you dead. Hello and welcome to Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy! It's insane it's to the me- Insane in the membrane! What? Indeed. Oh, but this is like a... <clears throat> like it says at the beginning of the game, it's a blast from the past. Ah, oh, the version of the software decline? license agreement is available. I accept! Do you know what you were accepting? No. Do you care? Nope. Okay. Um, so we're gonna start with Crash Bandicoot, because it's the fucking difficult one. <laughs> um, Back when games were really... Back when games were difficult. Mm -hmm. And um, we shall... We're, what we're going to do is take it turn about, turns about. So I'm starting off. So how should we do this? Should we... Uh, it's one of his dies we switch out? Or... Yeah, we'll swap out each life. Okay. Um, that way we, we all get... We, we'll probably both get a chance at doing most of the levels that way. Like mm. the first few levels are going to be a piece, piece of piss. But mm. it gets harder. Just like... No. Um, Everybody knows what you were going to say. <laughs> Moron. Oh, my oh, we need to hear this. Of course. My cortex commandos. To world cortex commandos. Look at how beautiful it looks in Gordon's HD. Whoa! What are they actually doing? Experimentations. Yeah. So, I never played before I got the re remaster trilogy, and I, I have already played through all this. Hmm. Um, I never played the first two. I only played Warped because I don't think I owned any of these games. Yeah. Um, but. I thought when it came out again, I was like, nah, I need to get this. And I uh, actually played through probably one of the most classic. Um, Bandicoot one trick to be rejected. Probably, probably the most classic PlayStation game you can think of. Yeah. You know, like, this guy, this guy. Look, it's the female. Um, she, she isn't the female that's in any of the other games. Um, so like, I guess she's Crash Bandicoot's girlfriend or something. Mm. But then when Candy comes in, is she supposed to be her his sister or something? Really? I th I'm not sure. I can't remember. But I thought it was weird how she's totally different to all the other ones. Yeah. Yeah, some amazing. So uh, uh, it's brilliant how it like shows you like, actually, what, you can, what can what can what you can do straight off the bat. I have a feeling you're going to need that actually. I'm going to need as many extra lives as possible. Wee, how do you slide again? Oh wait, you can't slide in this game. Shit. So, uh, so Dave. Yeah. Do you think you could do a run of this without dying? This first level. No, the game. The whole game, no. What about all three without dying? Well, the fact that I said no to the first thing you asked me it probably suggests yes for the next one. Yeah. Glorious three D. Glorious three D. Oh shit! I shouldn't have done that. Glorious to the D. I didn't get all the apples. All the purists out there are going to be like, "You loser! What you loser, man!" You so, like, see the boxes that are like ribbed for mm -hmm. your pleasure. They, um, if you jump on them, you get multiple uh, apples out of them. But because I, sp oh yes, I'm invincible. Because I spun an enemy into it, mm -hmm. um, it, see like that, like you can knock things into each other. Um, and because I did it with, oh shit, I need to do both. Of these things. Um, oh fuck! Well, At least like I died. died. I guess I didn't get this perfect. Um, yeah, sorry. When you knock a bad, like when you spin into a bad guy, they go flying like that and they knock into the next thing. But if you knock them into one of these ribbed ones, yeah, spin doctor, mm -hmm. then you don't get all the apples out of them because um, it just gets destroyed and you get like one apple. See, so like I even get multiple apples out of jumping on top of it. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I didn't realise I'd have to explain Crash Bandicoot to you. I actually zoned out halfway through that. Thanks, man. <laughs> well, if you're not listening, then we, how can we expect anyone to be listening? Uh, no, it wasn't because of that. It was uh, I was admiring the game. All oh, right. Well, it is a beautiful to, game. I didn't want to like mess with the game that often. I'm going to go for a, a maximum box collection because uh, I feel like I failed by dying, so mm. I'm going to get all the, the boxes. All the boxes, at least. Like, what you need to be really careful about is when you're going back like this, you can't really see the screen very easily. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can quite easily get killed. I can imagine like you'll just be like running along and there'll be like a cliff, 
Yeah, yeah so. or like even the enemies because they're move, moving and stuff. Mm. Like, I think I've got all the boxes. Is that question? The mark? thing at the mm. end here will tell me. Yeah, I got them. Yeah, ask Jim. So you got a gem if you get all the boxes? Yeah, there's a gem for beating all the boxes. There's a, other special gems. Uh, there's a key apparently. I didn't get the key. I don't know how you get the key. Yes, I'm amazing. Yes. Davy wins. Put the Davy wins thing up. But, um, uh, so well, yeah, you, you get can. to play level two. Go back to the first one again. Right, okay, so the Ankh is the um, time attack. If you need to do get first place to get the Ankh. Right, okay. I think there's like a bronze, silver, silver and gold. gold, or a platinum one as well, possibly. I can't remember. But yeah, we won't bother with that. We'll just go with the gems. Cool. We'll, we'll do our best. We're not going to try 100% in this because on you go. Well, I mean, go, go, go. it's not going to be fair for me who hasn't played it in like a million years. Well, I haven't played it since the last time I played this. When was that? Uh, when this came out the first time. So this, the reason we're playing this is because it's in the news again. You, you won't be able to break that. You have to spin it. Um... Um, it's a square spin, X is jump, that's all you've got. Hey, so what's that jump thing? on top of it. Extra jump, no, it's a TNT. What do you think it's an extra no, leg? The, the, the oh, the mask. mask. Yeah. That's a Aku Aku. Right, so um, he's you jump on good. This? He's yeah. Jump on it and jump away. Jump away. Jump away. Jump away. Yeah, it'll explode after three seconds. You don't want to be near it. Good. It counts as a box though. So you, if you want to get the gem at the end, you need to kill it. Yeah, okay. um, nitro boxes also count, but if you step on them, you die immediately. The the um, the. Uh, the Aku Aku thing mm -hmm. um, is a mask thing that you put on. So if you collect three of them, you go invincible. That's why I went invincible in the last one. All oh, right, I thought that was just because you got one off. No, you get you need to get three. That would be a bit over overpowered if you ah, if you could just jump on top of that one and bounce on it. Yeah, I just wasn't sure. Like I seen you go invincible, but I didn't know whether it was because you collected one. Yeah, honestly, it was not expecting to have to explain. Okay, so if you collect three of those uh -huh. in the level, you also get a bonus stage. Um, you need to do the bonus stage to get the gem for the 100% completion. The thing is, like a lot of people will be in the same boat as me. Will have played it like ages ago. Yeah, possibly. So you, you, it's probably good that you're explaining it. Yeah, you, you got lucky there. I think you did die if you weren't invincible. Probably. Anyway, Seize or checkpoints, obviously. You can just run through it when you're invincible. <laughs> so that's this. That's the extra level. You need to get another two of the faces. Right. Okay. Now you totally wasted that. It doesn't matter. Uh, you need to get another two of the faces and come back and get. you'll be able to get that. Right, okay. Um, what was I saying before? I thought you were explaining the, the game. Yeah, but... What part were you explaining? I don't remember. <laughs> oh, no, right, oh there's another one. So another you need another. I need another one. Yeah. Quite a lot of these, aren't you? Yeah, you don't have to kill them, by the way. You can just jump over them. Is there any benefit to killing them? Do they no, generate points? No, you don't that? get anything from killing them. And they respawn as well. TNT. Right, so you need to be careful. If you spin attack, the TNT will automatically explode. So what yeah. you need to do is jump and time your spin so that you only hit the, the life and not the TNT. But yeah. as soon as you do that, the TNT will start the three second countdown and you'll have to run. Right, okay, I don't think that's worth it. It is worth it, but okay. I would do it, but you know. You need to be right up next to Nice. Good job. Well, at least you got the boxes. Because see, oh, the other thing that the mask does is if you get hit, you you, you don't die. Don't die. I, I remember so, that part, that's what I was asking earlier on, but I didn't know. Oh, okay, that's maybe what I was explaining. It was the mask. I think that's what I was talking about. Right. The annoying thing is you don't get the body slam attack in this. Like, there's a lot of stuff going back and playing. Oh, there's the thing. Right, so can I go so in So you here? can go in there now, yeah. I don't know what the other thing was. I think you might have to. Ah, uh, that's what it is. You need to collect the coloured gems. So this is just a bonus stage. It's only it's only left and right. Um, but you need to collect all. Well, you don't need to collect all the boxes, but it's basically to get you to get more boxes and lives and stuff. Um, it, by the way, if you, if you hold X when you jump on a box, it, you jump higher. Oh, nice. So that's useful for like um, jumping over. Ah uh, no, oh, she was well, just there, man. She was right there. I thought that was me. Finish that was the you. Game. I know. Finished the game. You got your girlfriend back, but. Cortex is like, nah. Is that an extra life I got as well? Yes. Nice. You also get extra lives every time you collect 100 uh, apples or more. Did I just get hit there? You just get hit there, yeah. If you, you lost your, your guy. That's fine. But it's alright, we won't hold it against you. Except everyone. Jump again! Over. Oh shit. Oh well. That'll be you did. Oh shit, we were going to pass over saying we died, yeah. didn't we? But I didn't do that the first time I did. Right, just do it, just do it. We'll do a level about. I think we'll do a level about. Because if we do it every time we die, then... That'll be a nightmare. <laughs> oh, I could have beaten you if I just 
survive. If you just like not fall on him, he did my advice. Yeah. Right, so was this one you were a jump again? Yeah. Nice. So yeah, there's a lot of like flavor flavor. There's a lot of like um C mystery boxes. Oh. No. Oh well, what a shame. Um yeah. So much sympathy. Yeah. Such sympathy. Such sympathy. Such symphony of the night. Such um, symphony of the night. So. Uh, oh, look! You get hit by the boxes you don't collect. It's funny. How? The more you get hit hit by, the more he gets like knocked to the ground. It's really funny. Did you see the boxes I missed? I didn't actually, but I think it might have something to do with the TNT. No. See that? See that um, teleporter thing? Like the thing that didn't appear on the ground? I think you might have to get that first. Right. Because like, there's coloured gems that you can collect in this game as well, and they unlock certain features in other parts of the levels. Mm -hmm. So you can't do everything in the game um, the first time through. Well, shit. Yeah. Well, shit is right. But yeah, so you can't do the body slam and you can't do the slide in this. Uh, so like, that's fine if you've only played the first game. But um, after, after having played all three games, it's like there's so many like... Uh, quality of life improvements that they put in. It's so, like, I mean, I only played the first game. What's the body slam and what's the slide? What's, what's the advantage? Um, they're both attacks. So the slide lets you slide tackle enemies. Um, but it also gives you a way of getting more height. So, like, you can slide in enemies. Mm -hmm. And then... Um, or or you, can, you can actually, like... With the way the hitbox works, you can slide and then jump. So mm -hmm. it, it, gets, it lets you get further. Like, you can jump further. Um... Uh, oh yeah, you need to spin that. I was like waiting for that to turn there. Um, so yeah, it's useful for that. The body slam also gives you a bit of height mm -hmm. uh, when you jump. You can, if you hit the body slam, you can you can jump a little higher. Um, I know it doesn't matter. Apples aren't important. Boxes are important. Uh, these uh, these uh, monkeys are annoying. If they if they're rolling on the ground, you can't um, get them. You can't hit them yet. They kill you Im immediately. Whee! So uh, when did you first start playing this game? When did you first play it? What, this version of the game or the original? Oh, fuck. The original version. The original version. Um, well, like I say, I didn't play the first two, so when Warped came out, mm -hmm. uh, whenever that was. I don't remember when that was. Now that you've played uh, all three of them, yeah. you still reckon this is the hardest one? This basically? is definitely by far the hardest one. Basically from what, I, what I've been telling you with the slide and the body slam and stuff. So, like, the second one adds in um, a lot more... Uh, like quality of life things like the, sl the slide tackle and the body slam mm -hmm. but um, the third one's even easier than that you get like a at the end of the game you get a, an apple bazooka that like that automatically lets you shoot like any box on the screen or any enemy on the screen you get, a bit you get you get a lot of upgrades in the in the third game that isn't in any of the other games um, so it is the simplest I would say the second one is not easy but it's easier than this just because of the extra stuff that it's got in it like this one's really really um cruel to you mm -hmm. like the way the way that it, the pit boxes work and stuff like that you'll miss you'll miss a jump by like a millimeter like a bo literally a ball here off it mm. um and it's really unfair whereas um the second one's like got the slide and stuff like that oh i missed it eight boxes how did i miss eight boxes who knows? Oh wait, it's this thing. I've got to get that thing. I think that appears if you don't die. Right. Uh, did I die in this level? Uh, I, think I, did. I don't think you did, no. Nah, I, will. I have gone back and got some of these uh, in my own playthrough, but um, I don't remember how to get them, to be honest. <laughs> anyway, that's probably going to do us for episode one, so uh, thanks for joining us. Um, join us again... I have a habit of saying join us again next time, but sometimes I mean next week, and sometimes I mean next time, like the next video. I mean, technically next time could count as next week as well, so yeah. next time's a good one to... Okay, so join us next time <laughs> on uh, Crash Bandicoot Instant Trilogy, and we will continue on the... What was the next level called? Boulders. Boulders. We'll Mark, continue with some boulders. Mark's going to play with these boulders. Indeed. Indeed.